We may be in the early days of 2019, but for the Democrats, campaign 2020 is already shaping up. Natalie Brand has the latest from Washington. What you'd like to make. I am running for president of the United States. California Senator Kamala Harris made it official, announcing her presidential plans on Martin Luther King Day. I love my country, and I feel a sense of responsibility to stand up and fight for the best of who we are. Harris, a former California attorney general elected to the Senate in 2016, joins a growing field of Democratic hopefuls. As a mother, I cannot sit idly by. I will fight for your children as hard as I would fight for my own. New York Senator Kirsten Gillibrand announced her candidacy last week. And Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren launched her exploratory <laughs> committee on New Year's Eve, since then hitting the campaign trail in key primary states. Rules matter. Rules made in Washington matter, and that's why I'm in this fight. Hawaii Congresswoman Tulsi Gabbard also made her presidential aspirations known this month, along with former Secretary of Housing and Urban Development Julian Castro. It's time for new leadership. Then there's the long list of prominent names still rumored to be considering a run, from former Vice President Joe Biden to Senators Amy Klobuchar of Minnesota and Cory Booker of New Jersey. The question is, are we dissatisfied? Senator Booker honored Dr. Martin Luther King today at a rally in South Carolina, joining Senator Bernie Sanders at the event in a critical early voting state, already getting attention nearly one full year before 2020 even begins. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington. And Senator Harris plans to visit South Carolina on Friday before traveling back to officially kick off her campaign with a rally in Oakland.